as you've heard, welcome back to Sonic Frontiers. Today, we are at a whole new island, Oranos Island, after making our way through Rhea Island in the last episode. We learned the history of the Ancients and the Cocos, as well as freeing Eggman from cyberspace. So now we have to team up with them to actually save the day. But in the meantime, we have a whole island to explore. It looks like we have to do all the typical stuff here by going through the levels, getting Chaos Emeralds, all that kind of stuff. So we'll be busy at work in today's episode getting all that kind of stuff done. But I'm looking forward to it because, you know, we've sort of had a break from the action with the previous episode for sure. I'll grab whatever Cocos I can find. It looks like there might be a little little chest of them right here, right? Gotta open it up if it lets me. There it goes. So I'll definitely have to cash in a lot of these very soon because it is, is worth our while for sure. So anything else around here before we head out? Because right now it looks like all we gotta do is just collect all keys from Portal. So haven't seen any just yet, but if we can get some extra challenges done along the way, that'll clear up the map a lot. But there's our first key, no problem. Yeah, I wonder if there's any tokens to get here. I guess not, but I guess we'll see. Um, so what do we have to do for this? Oh, this is new. I guess I have to land on each platform probably without falling on the ground. Okay, let's be careful then. Luckily, Sonic can jump nice and high. And one more. Got it. Was that good enough? It was. So that's our first challenge sort of done in this area, and it should clear up a little bit of the map. Very nice. I don't know if this is going to be a huge island or not, but I guess we'll find out. I guess it's the hearts again that we got from you know the first island. What about this chest then? Is this going to be just a little speed boost over to this way? We can loop around big time. And now I guess we're landing on this. Where is this leading to? I'm not really sure. But I can go up this side. Got it. Oh yeah, so it is gonna be more of the Amy hearts. There you go, Sage's memory, oh, it's for Sage. Collect these heart-shaped memory tokens to talk to Sage. Memory tokens can be found by exploring on the island, fishing, and using the Psy Loop. That is so cool. And it lands us right at our first level. So we do not have a gear to access this one just yet, so we'll have to find one somewhere. I guess by taking on enemies and such, there were a couple of enemies over this way. Are these new ones? Whoa, I think they are. They're like circling around us right now. Uh, okay, I know how to parry. I know, I know how to do that. I was I was hoping the training simulator would tell me a little bit more about these enemies, but uh, here, try that again. So I guess we just, this is so weird. Whoa, I did it, I did it. Whoa, I gotta do it again now. Uh oh, that wasn't good. So I guess I just keep parrying until they, ow, oh, stop. I gotta get closer to the center of the ring. This is not good. Uh! Oh no, <laughs> I wasn't ready. Got it. Got it. There you go. Much better. Oh, we're destroying them now. You guys are in so much trouble. Oh, we got a key out of that one? That's huge, actually. Oh, no, come on. You're the last one. You're going around me again. Nice. Finish you off. That's what I'm talking about. We get another Sage Heart then, and a little bit of experience, a whole bunch of stuff, really. That was so cool, so that was a whole new enemy. And did the rings come back for this one? I guess so. Huh. So what else can I do around here? If not that, there's gotta be something else. Well, there was something up there. How do I get up that way? I guess it's like this, but I'm just looking for the gears for now. To do that, we might just have to find some guardians to take on. So yeah, we'll, we'll head off here for now and see what else we find. But it might be good to do the infinity boost so we can get moving a little bit faster. I'm a little curious what was inside that box. Because sometimes you can find gears just out in the wild as a random drop. Not always though. Oh, easy prey trophy earned. I wonder what that was for. Maybe that was for defeating every type of enemy? I sure hope so. But oh, we have a new challenge here. This one, I'm guessing, has to do with this. Catch the falling target spheres. Uh, okay. I gotta catch them? Where are they? Uh, did I do it? Did that count? I, I, I guess? That was the weirdest one yet. But hey, we got it, that's awesome. And that's another seed for us. And more stuff cleared out, really nice. Oh, but it looks like we did pass a guardian over there. So first we'll grab this, then we'll take a look at our map. If I could just track that, that's gonna be over this way. And ooh. What's going on over here? It looks like we have one just waiting for us right there. But that's the way I have to go. Hmm. 
You know, that's a normal enemy. We've seen those guys before. But I think right over here, oh boy, it's the red pillar. Have we fought this one before? I think so. Oh my goodness, maybe not, maybe not in this way. So let's see if I can't just side loop it. Well, that's not what I intended. I did not mean to walk up it. Come on, run, run, run. There you go. Okay, that might be the way to go at it. It's working pretty well so far, but it is starting to move, which makes it a bit more complicated. Ow, okay. Can I attack it like this? I wanted to try, no, not like that. Okay, that is a little scary too. It is making this, ow. Oh geez. Okay, now's our chance, now's our chance, but it's moving away. That still broke it though. I was gonna try doing the side loop attack, but it just didn't really let me do that. Oh my goodness, we're losing all of our rings right now. So let's make sure we just pick up a couple of them before this starts going crazy. There we go, there we go. If we could just keep up with it, like that, much better. No, I didn't wanna do that. Ah, oh, that's so silly. Come on, come on. That didn't do it at all, okay. Hold on, go back, lock on to them. See, that's what I wanted to do before, but it was not any. There you go. I lost some rings for it, but we are getting closer to defeating it, so that's good. Come on, come on. I don't wanna attack it right now because it's all spiky. Whoa, jeez, give me a chance here. There we go. Oh, that's good. Come on, just a little bit more like that. That's all we need. But it's way up there now, so. I'll just try to do that. It didn't quite work, but I think we can finish it off right there. We got it. Awesome. That was intense. But look at this, our first gear of Oranos Island. And that should be enough just to get us situated back over here. Because we only have two keys so far. I don't think that would be enough to unlock the first Chaos Emerald. But I guess we'll see soon enough. For right now, we're just taking this whole sort of obstacle course. And it was right over which way? I think over there, yeah. So this shouldn't get me too much. Should be a little bit of a shortcut though. Almost there. It was right over this way, yeah. So. This should be good. Access requirement is just one, which is exactly what we have. So let's go for our first level here of Ornos Island. Hopefully it goes well. Might be a bit more challenging now that we're definitely coming up on the end of the game. I'm pretty sure this is the last island, so I'm sure that the difficulty will be pretty high. But I guess we'll see for ourselves, this is 4-1. So I guess it guarantees that yeah, there's definitely no levels on Raya Island. Okay, let's get going. Oh, this one is so cool. I'm liking this a lot. Even though it is, you know, just chemical plant zone again, the vibe is a lot different. So I like that a lot already. Oh no, okay, well that, that I don't so much. I jumped, I thought I was already on the ground. Yeah, we'll just have to try our best to get through this one and get all the red star rings first things first. Then we'll worry about our good speed and everything like that. But visually this looks so much fun. Oh, and I can light speed dash through all that. Oh, get it. Whoa, wait, I saw it, I saw it way over. Oh no. Uh, got it. Ah. Okay, we made it somehow. That was the first red star ring. And then there's probably another one up there. Whoops. Okay, lesson learned. I'd rather, you know, take it the hard way for now. Oh yeah, look at this. Whoa. Much better. And then we can dash through that one. That was awesome. So that's definitely gonna be faster. Yeah, just like learn everything now so that we can go for it again and get a good time just without too much problems. There's our second red star ring through that light dash. I like this music too, just so intense. Soundtrack for this game has been fantastic, so happy to hear more of it. Let's dash through these guys too. Whoa, what is, oh, we got the glider. This is so cool too, but it doesn't really get us too far. We're just looking for two more red star rings. They gotta be somewhere nearby. Oh, there it is. Wait, 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 turn back. I'm not, I'm not ready for this. Can I just go backwards? Oh no, it is launching me so far. Uh, 
Whoa, we're on a skateboard? This is so cool though. Whoa, look at Sonic. Wait, there, I missed a bunch of stuff. We're going back, I'm sorry. I don't mean to ruin the, the skateboard moment. That was awesome now. So this time, I gotta jump over one of these. Oh, wait, what? Uh, that was weird. <laughs> okay, now the game's just being silly. We're gonna try that again. Just gotta land. There was a spot where I need to jump. I don't know what's going on with the controls right now. Was it here? Not quite. I think it was there. I pressed the light dash button and nothing happened. I don't understand. Okay, I got it this time. Finally, that took a lot of tries for some reason. But now we just need to go back around. You'll get a loop around the whole thing again. But then we go into the cannon, get launched through, and then we can do this really cool skateboarding section where I did see the other red star ring. It was sort of to the left, so we just gotta watch out for that. Right here, right here, ready? Got it, perfect. That is so cool. We jumped off of it there, but what a fun little section. So we're gonna slam down, get through this, but then we just gotta try again and go a little bit faster. I'm sure that'll be enough for our, and we need 130 rings, but S rank is just a minute 45. I honestly think we can do that pretty easily. So I'm gonna press triangle to try again and just go for it. If we don't die at all, I think it'll be pretty easy to handle. Especially if we take some of those shortcuts we found, that should be great, or that could happen. <laughs> I always boost at the wrong time. Okay, try it again. Okay, so we're just gonna loop around this really quick. Much better. And I tried to dash onto them there, but it just didn't really let me, so here we go. Then we will press the button a bunch there, but I remembered we gotta go through here, down now, like that. And definitely that helps, but I don't know why we went way to the left. I was holding forward. Out of the game's being really silly. All right, I'm coming up on the end here and I think I'm going fast enough just to win this here. Ready, and boom, got it, perfect. So there we go, that should be the 120 rings we need. The S rank time, oh it's 130, no! I thought it was only 120, darn. Okay, so I'll do it one more time and then we'll be good. All right, it took some work, but we finally got all of the missions done in that level, so we should be getting seven keys in total. So added on to our, I think we already had two of them, we should have nine in total. Should be green. Got lots of hard work going on here. But we still have plenty more to discover around, so we'll just keep at it. A vault was unsealed. It can now be opened with a vault key. It is the blue Chaos Emerald here on the Orobos Island, or Oranos, I think. We'll get the red one as well, so that's pretty cool. Oranos, that's what it is. <laughs> There we go, well, let's definitely get those two Chaos Emeralds. We got one off in the distance there and one off in the distance here. The blue one is definitely closer though, so we'll work on that first. I might wanna go up this way because I think we went up that way last time. Yeah, there's just sort of some more to experience this way as well. Because we need to get a little bit of everything. A little bit more of the, uh, the keys, the gears, the uh, tokens, whatever we can end up finding. Hold on, there we go, that's a bit better. And we got one. Ooh, and any other challenges we can find. So it looks like we might need to side loop around this thing. And that was gonna give us, oh man. This one looks a little complicated, but I'll knock that over. Wait, it didn't work? Why? There we go, that worked. This didn't go quite far enough before it just faded away. Uh, that is a bit weird. There we go, that's three out of five. See, why is it fading away before it can even reach it? Okay, there we go, it's just at the very tail end of it. Oh no, proving to be a bit difficult. Come on, that's it. How is that not it? There we go, that one was sort of silly, but we figured it out, MO81 is completed. Another seed and a little bit more of the map as per usual. Very cool. So that clears up a lot for us to do. It looks like there's another one up ahead, but I might not be able to do that one just yet. Regardless, it's a little far off what we're looking for. We'll go up here instead. Whoa, uh, okay, that didn't quite work. Let's try that again. So it looks like that can get me something up there. What do I gotta do? I think I just gotta jump into it. There we go, much better. 
Whoa, and we got the caterpillar. Look at this thing. Looks a lot more like a beetle to me, but the caterpillar. Whoa, what is it gonna do? Whoa. Oh my gosh, we're getting sucked up into it. I don't think I can touch those. Maybe I can touch the blue ones. Oh, I can touch the blue ones. We're moving too fast almost. I'm gonna jump over this and then hit this one. Whoa, okay, I was not ready for that. This is wild. Got it. Oh no, I missed that one, come on. Thing is, is that you can just whip around so quickly. So it's gonna break another one. I'll jump onto this, get it? We just need to break one more. What is the golden stuff gonna be though? Oh, uh, not that. <laughs> I thought I was supposed to collect it. Am I supposed to dash into it? I guess that was so counter, uh, or anticlimactic. <laughs> oh my goodness. Let's try that again. Yep, fight the caterpillar. So this time I need to be on those rails and just hit the blue ones. I guess the yellow ones hurt me too. We can handle it this time now. I know a lot more about what I'm doing. Jeez, you move so quick with that though, it's crazy. Okay, jump over that. And then same deal with this. I, I jump, I jumped too late. Oh my goodness, you're kidding me. Jump over, oh my gosh. So I'm out of rings again. See, how is that? I got a double jump for it or something? I'm going right through it. Is it, is it over here? I can't tell what's going on right now. How did I go through it so many times? Is it, yeah, I guess it's between, that is so silly. It's between the rails. It's so hard to tell though. Sonic is so small on the screen too. I don't know. Okay, again, we're here. I'm going to immediately earn up some rings. Just like that. Okay, 30 will hopefully be enough because this monster needs to go down. He's caused me too much of a headache. And then I, as soon as it's done shooting, there we go. Now we're gonna go for it. Do as much damage as we can muster. That was pretty good. Oh, we are really bringing it to them now. Come on. They still have quite a lot left though. I'm a bit scared, but all these combos are going out. It's very cool. Uh-oh. Oh, but here we go again. So hopefully I can handle it a little bit better this time, but I'm a bit doubtful. Got it. That's good. Yeah, I stay under for that one, but I need to, oh, come on. This thing is moving so quick though. I think I can stay under it there, jump over it like this. Jump again. I wanna dash onto that, grab this one, and we're back on the rail. I was not ready for any of that. It just, it goes at you so fast. And getting hit removes so many of your rings. This one is like one of the toughest guardian fights yet. I might be able to just get in one go this time. Almost, I think we did. I don't know why I got so lucky this time just to have to not do a second phase, but I'm certainly not complaining. Thank goodness that thing is out of the way. That was a mess. That was so difficult. Anyways, now that's through, Wonder what else we can do around here. Looks like there's definitely a couple of hearts to grab. Some of them sort of on the way out though. I think for right now we'll just try to hop up here, deal with these enemies a little bit. Got some extra experience I don't really need. But here we go, our first Chaos Emerald of Oranos Island is waiting for us right over here. We, we have enough keys for it, so let's give it a try. All right, well, here we go. Glad to have it. So, first of seven, I would like to get a couple more in today's episode, but that is definitely a great start. And what do we have in here? Oh, nice, another collection of parts and stuff. I see a couple of Coco to grab. We've got a good collection of them, but there's still more to get. But there is some stuff down this way. I might wanna track this. And then we'll look out for the next Chaos Emerald. So what will we find off this way? Oh no, hold on Sonic, please be careful. There's another heart for us. Try this out a little bit. Where are we going? I have no clue. I guess we're going the right way though. At least to some degree. Oh, there's a challenge here, yeah, okay, got it. Okay, I see this one. I think I need to do this part first. 
and then this part? I don't even think we do the purple one. Will that work? Oh, I see. Can I start over then? Because I, I did this one wrong. I didn't see the purple one was on the back. So we do blue, purple, I guess gray. Yep, not quite gonna work. So, or purple, blue, gray. Got it. Much better, this should line up. That's what I'm talking about. It makes like a little, little horse or something. I like it. That's another seed for us, as per usual. To be expected, that's a lot of the southern part of the island cleared out quite well. And there's the fishing spot and some of the memory spots too. Most of those we'll worry about in another episode. But for right now, our next Chaos Emerald is waiting for us way over there, as well as a couple more of those enemies. We've already beaten them once. I don't know if I need to do this too much more, but they've caught, I've caught their attention. So we'll just block as many as we can manage. I think that's all of them. So we just gotta go crazy on as many as possible. Oh, we hit two of them at once there. We do get a lot of rewards for it though, which is always nice. So, did we finish you? Uh, excuse me? Okay, that was odd. He just wasn't letting me attack them anymore. They can only take one more hit. <laughs> there you go. See, was that so hard? Okay, let's get going then. All the way over there is our current goal, but if we can pick up a couple more hearts along the way, because you know these memories are important again. They might be necessary later on. You know, we, we've seen that with the previous areas. Why didn't that work? The camera sort of forces, okay, I think I'm going at it backwards, so we'll leave it. I don't wanna go too far out of my way for them. Just because we'll have more opportunities later. But there is another uh, level here. Maybe I should just take this on while I have the opportunity? Sure, why not? So, we need one gear to access this one, and that's exactly what we have. So let's open up this level and see what we get inside. I'm guessing this will be four or two, but it might not be. We'll just have to sort of wait and see. Uh, this is four or two. Awesome, we'll grab these cocoa and then we're gonna get started. Ooh, look at this place. Going through a tube, just in the middle of the city. I like it, that is so cool. We're just gonna speed through the highway now. Oh man. Whoa, I stopped there for some reason. What was that about? I'm not quite sure, but yeah, it seems like at every, whoa, break in the highway there, I have to stop and then like rebuild speed or something. Oh, I see this ring over this way. I wanna take that one. Whoa, this is an entire alternate path. I like it. This is a very cool level so far. I'll try to, okay, uh, dash through all that stuff, but haven't seen any more red star rings. Whoa, whoa, okay, that, that just, <laughs> this is all really throwing me off. What is happening right now? We're back at the beginning. That's not what I wanted, but it's okay. Maybe I should try the main path instead and see if there's actually any red star rings waiting around, but I don't think I missed any. I'll grab this. Or maybe it's because I was light dashing. I'm not sure. Maybe that slowed me down a little bit. But let's go this way instead. Are there any red star rings along this path? There might be something like up here. Whoa, that was not the way I thought that would bring me. Oh, but there is, so you know what? It was worth it in the end, because now we can go like that, grab that one. We should be back towards that path. But that was definitely slower than the other way, so all good stuff to keep in mind. But no way, I saw another red star ring. Okay, we're fine actually, I think. Uh, right up here, got it, perfect. So we're at three of them already, zooming through this. Wait, got it. <laughs> I'm just sort of hitting everything as it comes to me which is a little scary to do because it's coming at us fast. Oh, I see another red star ring down there. Can I turn back? No, I can't. Oh, that's my least favorite part is when you just zoom by them and there's nothing to be done about it. But we are going so quick right now. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, we got a checkpoint. For better or for worse. I already know I'll have to replay through the level one for one of the red star rings. Wait, there it was, there it was. Ah, oh, I cannot turn around. Okay, I can, but there it is. That was some fancy movement. Very lucky with that one. So we have to replay through the level one more time at the least for the red star ring. We need to also get the S rank for a minute and 15 seconds and clear with 120 rings in total. Okay, stay it up like that this time. And then if I just slam down, okay, that sort of almost worked. Just need to do it sooner. 
There we go, so that's all the red star rings. I'm going to try to rush through now and get the S rank, but I don't think I'll be able to do it quite in time, but I'm glad at the least we have all the red star rings now. Okay, I think I just got both of them. The ring requirement and the S rank. Definitely hard to grind up there, but we did get both of them. Oh my goodness, lots of hard work into this level. But this was definitely one of my favorite 3D levels yet. It was just so much fun, the blaster. Once you sort of figure out where you're going, very cool one for sure. So I like it, definitely. But let's see, we'll, we'll get some extra keys from this, which will be great because we're heading over already to another Chaos Armor that I think we already had unlocked. So. Hope we can get some extra stuff here, but two vault keys and we'll get a couple extra, but a vault was unsealed and can now be opened with a vault key. So now we have the red emerald and the green emerald ready and waiting for us. Will there be another one though? Or will that be it? That's it for now. So let's try to find the red one. Um, if I take a look, the red emerald is not on our map yet, but it's over there. Okay, so the green emerald is over that way. If I can find a couple of challenges along the way, that would be a great goal too, but so far I've been really enjoying just our exploration through Oranos Island. We get another key, that is really useful. We're up to 18 of them now. And a couple of Akoka waiting for us. Don't mind if I do, collect all of you guys. And there's a whole lot happening over here. How do I get started with it though, I guess? Do I do this? How do I get up there? Um, it looks like maybe that's more of an exit than an entrance. I really have no clue. Sometimes the game's weird like that. Maybe we can... That thing is huge. It looks important. Yeah, it does. Huh. I love hearing more about, you know, the world in that way and just Sonic sort of posturing on it. Oh my gosh. I'm not doing so well at riding around rings in today's episode. But see, I can get up here. And now I can go down this way. I don't know if that's what I'm supposed to be doing right now, but I just will make the most of it. And that really was it. I feel like there's something more here that we'll figure out later. So not gonna sweat it too much. But over this way. Of the infinity. 500 meters away, so we're getting closer. What about this one? This one will probably just be a spring or something. Oh no, I was wrong. Extra hearts for us. Haven't even talked to Sage too much, but I'm sure they'll pop up soon enough. Whoa, look at this huge flower field. Oh, this is so pretty. I wanna see this again when it's not raining, but alrighty, it's very, very stunning visually. Okay, that's not where I wanted to go. Huh. Oh, here we go. I asked for it and I got it. Look at how pretty this is. Whoa, just to be able to run through this with Sonic is so awesome. And this looks like a new enemy. It's Konoichi. Or Konoichi, maybe? I'm not really sure. But um, we'll get it from that. There we go, much better. We've, we've fought off with Ninja, and I think it was Samurai was the other one. I can't quite remember, but. Oh my goodness, I was not ready for that. Uh, please let me get up first. Okay, go for it again. I'm trying to, yeah, do some different moves here. Oh, I tried to parry that one. That one does not seem parryable. Just gotta grab a couple of rings. Oh my gosh. It is so lightning fast. Come on, please. There we go, much better. Ooh, that's gonna bring the pain quite a lot. And I think, yeah, that was Kunoichi defeated. And another gear for us. Very cool to get that. And we're fighting off with more guardians, which is always good. So let's get another Chaos Emerald right here. I'll grab this stuff first. Extra hearts. Okay, so lots of hard work today getting these keys to unlock these emeralds, but it's well worth it. This one just needed six keys, so we've had it for a while. Ta-da, the red chaos emerald. And so now we're off back over that way to get the green one. So let me try to get this, it lets me. Oh, and while we're here, we get another key and we can talk to you. So let's see what they can give us. Yeah, they, they, they exchange for the seeds and stuff. Whoa, 51 and 54, so we didn't get a ton since we've last talked to them, but it's still good progress. All right, we don't need anything else from them now. We can keep going down this way. Whoa, building up some pretty major speed too. Got it. We're good to go. Ooh, another one of these challenges. This one looks a lot more complicated, but 
I need to circle around this little gray one first, I think. That looks about right. Then we do the yellow one, if I had to guess. So the yellow one is this one right here. Got it? Let's see if that works. It's looking pretty good. Then we go to maybe the blue one. Okay, looking good. Now the purple one, right? Yep, the, definitely the purple one. Purple and then gray. If that worked, that is. Come on. <laughs> awesome. See that the slots in there perfectly. And then lastly, this gray one to make this sort of prism shape. Excellent, so another mission done. That was a lot more sort of tricky, intuitive. You really had to think about it. Which I appreciate a lot more. And that clears out another good chunk. So a lot more to do in that regard, but I guess if we wanna move on with the story, we need to go and talk to Sage with the memory tokens there. I mean, I guess this may be the best way to get around regardless, so we'll keep working on that. We'll talk to Sage, we'll try to get to the ye yellow, not yellow, green Chaos Emerald. Should be good. We're almost there. Hmm, what is down there? Oh my goodness. Quite a lot, it seems. But we do get the spring. It seems like a lot of these little challenges and you know obstacles that we're finding across the island are getting a whole lot more challenging than they were, you know, at the beginning of the game. That was cool. But it also sort of ruined me. It killed my momentum for some reason. I don't know why, but maybe not the best one to try. Okay, we'll just we'll go the normal way. I'd rather not risk doing that again. Cause it's just a, you know, a simple run over this way. So we should be able to boost over no problem. We're also almost at level 99. We're at 83 so far. So we're closing in on that. I'm very curious to see if that will get us anything or if that's just, you know, where it stops. I mean, it might go farther. Maybe it just goes to 100 and beyond. Okay, where is this gonna bring me? Now I'm curious. Launches me straight up and then all the way over. No, I did the wrong one. Hold on, go back. I wanna see it. Let's try to get up again. X, and then it was square. Okay. And we should land right next to Sage. Hi Sage, we need 23? I have enough. Continue exploring the island until then. Oh no, okay, I thought I was saying we need 23 in total. We need 23 more. Gotcha. And because of that, I don't know if there's actually an easy way to get over. Yeah, I can't really see too much of a way to get over to the island for right now. So maybe that is where we should leave it for now and we'll try to explore more of it later. Cause you know, this was a great introduction to it, but it seems like there's still a lot more left to do um, through Ornos Island. So that being said, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Sonic Frontiers. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.